Hey guys, Bridget here. In this video, we're going to explore five of some of the most voted Webflow sites of the month. And the very first website is going to be svz.io. Now, as you can see right off the bat, we're greeted with this transition animation, which is in an infinite loop, which immediately sets the tone of the website. Now, as we're scrolling, I really like uh, the mix between uh, this transition, which is uh, quite uh, on uh, the faster side, uh, but at the, at the same time, uh, right below, we have social proof uh, with uh, big uh, company logos, uh, which uh, are clearly defined, but uh, with uh, a slower pace. So this really helps creating that contrast, which uh, makes the overall impression of the website look really, really good and professional. Now, also right away, we are also communicated what are the services or the products of the company. So this is, uh, this is really good. You always want to make it very clear for the users what is uh, the benefit uh, for them and uh, what are the services or products that they offer so that uh, you don't keep them uh, guessing. Now, after that, uh, there's going to be some uh, work, which uh, again, really smooth, uh, really like the transitions uh, as uh, you're seeing uh, these new work elements uh, coming up. Uh, and then some testimonials, which uh, obviously are always uh, good uh, for social proofs. Now, as we go here, we are seeing these resources which, with this amazing uh, animation, which uh, was uh, very smooth, and then call to action at the end. So overall, very polished, uh, clear, straight to the point, uh, nothing uh, you know too over the top, uh, but uh, really nice uh, uh, animation and uh, uh, user experience overall. The very next one is ready.co, which uh, as you can see, it's uh, a calendar app. I really like how bold this is. Uh, and uh, if we replay it from the start, you see this uh, very nice uh, animation and touch uh, on the top. And uh, also when it comes to the apps, uh, I really like uh, these type of headers where I'm immediately seeing what the product is about. Uh, as well as uh, with this uh, animation, I already see a glimpse uh, of uh, how it works. Uh, and uh, this uh, really helps uh, minimize the gap between just having a, a still image and having a video, which uh, even a 30 second videos might not seem like a, a big ask for the user, but it really is. And this, uh, that plays out in autopilot, this GIF or video that were really used uh, really communicates a lot in a short amount of time. So big uh, emphasis uh, and uh, props uh, for them uh, in structuring it this way. And as we see over here, as, as we're going down, there is this very nice transition that's happening. It's going to enable us to see even more about the product uh, and then some more features uh, elements which are useful to communicate to the user, all stylized in a very nice and uh, fresh way overall. So this uh, is really nice, uh, straight to the point again, uh, and uh, very visual and a light uh, user experience for the user. The very next one is a super list. And as you can see, we are immediately greeted with uh, this uh, very nice uh, effect, uh, which uh, the cursor is, is essentially chasing uh, uh, this uh, line, uh, which uh, shows right away this um, dark and uh, light UI transition. And as we go down, uh, you can see that uh, there's a lot uh, that uh, is being shown uh, right away, but in a very clear way. So very similarly to the previous site, uh, really love these animations which show about uh, the product and give you more insights uh, into what uh, is uh, this all about, what are the main features, and uh, not having uh, us uh, having to click uh, on, a, on a video and uh, having to go through all of that. Uh, this is really, really curated, really nice uh, and uh, fast uh, to communicate to the user exactly what we're about. Plus also these 
nice uh, touches when it comes to the UI components. Uh, these are just uh, really, really nice. Next one has a different feeling, which uh, as uh, some of you may know, it's almost, uh, it almost feels more on the graphic uh, design uh, style that uh, uh, maybe you were used to when you're thinking about uh, Bauhaus or some of the older design styles, but I really, really enjoy this, uh, this feeling overall. It kind of brings me back to the type of designs that I was studying when I was attending uh, a design university. And uh, yeah, overall, very clear. I really like this uh, scrolling interruption where you're going from vertically to horizontal scroll. This really helps uh, make uh, the layout uh, and uh, the general video experience uh, or web experience uh, less uh, boring, if you wish. So it really adds uh, to the overall uh, experience. Uh, and um, yeah, just a uh, very nice, uh, very curated and uh, great uh, touch on this overall. Now, the very last one is going to be more of a commercial website, uh, meaning that it's a big brand that uh, I'm sure a lot of you are going to recognize, Michael Kors Collection. This uh, website uh, uh, greets us with uh, a really nice and curated uh, video right away. And I really like this uh, menu where you're almost uh, seeing the background with this uh, glass effect uh, applied to it. Uh, very elegant, uh, very nice overall, and uh, different uh, type of website compared to the previous one. This really feels uh, elite, uh, and of course it's uh, um, Michael Kors, so you're going to have uh, that branding applied to the experience, which beautifully translated into this uh, website. So really hope uh, this uh, video was uh, inspiring for you. And uh, I remind you that uh, if you want to learn more about uh, design uh, and uh, web design, uh, you can see either the videos on my YouTube or and also feel free to subscribe to my newsletter. I don't really send uh, many emails uh, during the month, but the ones that I do I always uh, do my best to pack them with value. So that's uh, pretty much it for this video and I'll see you in the very next one.